fighting citizen. Right then, the Anvil Pisces. Probably the cutest ship in the game right now. But is it any good? And is it worth getting as a starter ship? Let's find out. First of all, what is it? Originally designed as a dedicated support craft for the mighty Anvil Karak, the Pisces is a cheeky little monkey that comes in two variants, the bog standard C8 and an expedition variant, the C8X. The only real difference between the two is the C8X has two extra size 1P shooters and a snazzy paint job. Otherwise they're identical. The C8 comes as standard with the Karak, but the C8X is currently on sale as a standalone ship, or as part of a starter pack on the Pledge store. Right, let's take a gander at those stats then. Although fairly petite, the Pisces does have a quantum drive, two additional jump seats, plus 4 SCU of cargo space, so although it won't be much competition for the Hull series, you can at least carry something in it. What the Pisces is good at however, is as a short range reconnaissance and exploration vessel. The idea is, that you'll rock up in a system with your Karak, do a sensor sweep, and identify points of interest for closer examination. Then, you can send out your Pisces for a closer look, while keeping the mothership at a safe distance. Basically, think Star Trek Shuttle. A small utility craft that's great for away missions and shopping. It's a minivan with a quantum drive. The space equivalent of a transit van. Access to the Pisces is via a loading ramp style backdoor located at the rear, similar to the Valkyrie. Okay, so what if you want to push things into your Pisces, what can it take? Not much. No other vehicles will currently fit inside the Pisces. But what if you want to push your Pisces into other things? Well, it obviously fits snugly into the Karak, and it will fit in the 890 as well, but that's about it. Performance wise the Pisces is pretty zippy, it will hit its maximum speed fairly quickly, even without afterburner, but the brakes are a lot less good. So take care not to face plant landing pads, and the handling is pretty much what you would expect for a mosquito sized ship, be sure to stock up on vomit bags. The Pisces is a great little ship for running delivery missions around local planetary systems, and earning those sweet sweet credits, until you're able to start cargo hauling, or want to do pew pew missions. Because you are not going to want to do any pew pew in this ship, as even though it does have a shield generator, it's about as much use as tits on a goldfish. A stiff breeze could likely murder this ship. So be careful. And it's utterly fucking useless at mining. So would I buy one? You bet your ass I would. In fact I already did. And I'm loving it. But would I recommend it as a starter pack? Yes. Providing you don't have any plans to pew pew with it. So there you have it. The Anvil Pisces. Who says fun things don't come in small packages. As always. Thanks for watching. And a huge thank you to all my new subscribers. You all rock.